Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. Today we're going to be doing a Pink Diamond Frank Nilakina gameplay video. And um, this Frank Nilakina card looks like a really, really solid option. He is from the glitched market. Um, I'm on one of my boys' accounts. Shout out to my guy Spencer. I'll leave his Twitter link in the description below. But he let me hop on his account and uh, use this Frank Nilakina card because I personally haven't been able to access the glitched market at all. But this Frank Nilakina card looked really, really interesting. And uh, I'm looking forward to doing a gameplay on him. So, uh, yeah, before we hop into it, I just want to thank y'all for um, allowing me to hit 1,000 subscribers today. Uh, I thought that was really, really cool. Uh, I am recording this video on Tuesday. It will be dropped on Wednesday, but we did hit 1,000 subscribers today, Tuesday, which is really, really cool. And I appreciate all the support on the recent videos and all the new subscribers. Um, if y'all have not hit that subscribe button yet, I would really appreciate it. If you would, it's free to, it's free to subscribe, and you can unsubscribe at any time if you change your mind. Um, but yeah, let's hop right into this video, see what this Frank Nilakina card is all about. So he's a 96 overall point guard shooting guard, obviously. He's 91 offense, 99 defense, 6'6". Six six. He's got like a 7-foot wingspan from 2KDB. 88 driving layup 89 three-pointer 85 driving dunk 86 ball handle so his offensive stats are not crazy but then his defense looks really good 96 block 90 or 96 steel 95 perimeter uh 93 speed through the ball acceleration and 96 lateral quickness and then you look at his badges he comes a 30 hall of fame badge which is really really good hall of fame catch and shoot ankle breaker dimer pickpocket pick dodger clamps heart crusher interceptor intimidator a lot of sh really good defensive badges also comes with downhill quick first step tight handles unpluckable floor general and then a bunch of gold badges like showtime slither finisher bailout handles for days stop and go flexible release screen machine hot zone hunter range brick wall just some really solid gold badges as well so overall i think this frank nilakina card looks super solid i'm really excited to use it so let's hop into freestyle and see what his animations are about hopping into freestyle let's see how frank moves he's got a really nice player model six foot six you would hope so and he's got a good release he comes with that base for it's that donovan mitchell release not a bad release it's pretty quick easy to get off um i personally struggle with this release a little bit i have struggled with it on donovan mitchell in the past but we'll see if we can get it down to a relatively green point um i just want to be able to green my open shots i'm really excited to use this card defensively specifically but as long as he can be serviceable on offense move well knock down some open shots um hopefully green a couple and attack the rim well that that's really all i want from this card in the offensive end but he does obviously come with the curry slide he i assume has some pretty decent dunk animations and it does look like he definitely does have some good showtime dunk animations and let's check out his full court dribble six um his behind the back is he has pro three Ooh, that's interesting he has pro three behind the back that is interesting so they juice this card up a little bit with his animations. Between the legs, look like it's Magic Johnson's between the legs isn't bad, but I think this card's actually going to be able to move and groove pretty good on the offensive end. I'm excited to use him. Let's hop into an unlimited game and see what he can do. Hopping into this unlimited game, we are matched up against Derrick Rose, Ray Allen, Clyde Drexler, Pau Gasol, and DeAndre Ayton. Not a bad team, not a great team. Let's see what Frank Nilakina can get to do. Rough start to this game. We'll see if we can get Nilakina going. I've missed a shot from the outside see if we can get a better look here we get a good look and he knocks down a white let's go i got a green that i'm slightly early we will definitely adjust not the best start to this game not the worst but uh we're gonna have to definitely see if we can get it going a little bit better on the offensive end knocks down another white let's go i got a green that i'm slightly early on both of my shots so far and uh, as i've said before i'm not the best with this base space four i struggle with personally but i think i should still be able to do a decent job he does not He's not moving amazingly so far. I'll say that. Attacking the rim, though. Look at the contact jam. Okay, Frank. I see you. That's beautiful. You love to see that. I need you to sit on defense for me, Frank. Good defense. I'm not even sure who got that bump. Grab the ball. Can we chill? Good pass. Frank for three. Green animation. Let's go. Smacking another white. I think that one might have been green. We will take it. Let's go. Throws it right to me. Good. Oh, I turned it back over. That's so tough. Damn. Come on, Frank. Let's go. It's a tie game. I need you to go get me a couple buckets. Good. Attacking the rim. D-Rose can't hold. You beautiful. Blow by. Showtime slam. We'll take it. Let's go. And he does have lock takeover as well. I mean, I think defensively this card should be exceptional. The question with him is going to be, can he compete on the offensive end of the court? Just reset. Go get another bucket. Let's go. He ain't really guarding me very well. Dot me. Look at Frank. Dot. Beautiful shot. Let's go, Giannis. I'm not graining so far this game, but we'll take that. Now we got a mismatch. Yep. Space the floor. Good. Now attack the rim. And... 
Ooh, nice finish. I'm surprised he got that off. 15%. That's what I love to see. A nice contact layup. Frank is playing really, really well so far. Even though I got a green, I got to play better. Great defense, Frank. Or not Frank. Uh, AK, I said Frank. Just used to Frank playing great defense, I guess. Coming off a screen, we're going to dish the ball. We'll take our dunk. Good, D-Rob. And one, baby. Let's get it. Beautiful job. Frank is distributing really, really well. And he's starting to require more attention off that screen because he's been knocking down his shots, even though I haven't been greening him. So we'll take that. Attack the rim. Blow by. Beautiful, Frank. Let's go. Showtime slam me. Let's get it. Let's get some defense going. Beautiful. Pump fake. I wanted to shoot it, but we didn't have enough space. Coming off the screen wide open for three. Come on, Frank. I got a green, bro. He throw. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Defensive animations of hell, though. Golly, Frank, look at you. And I freaking smoke immediately. That's annoying. It's my fault. All right, let's reset. I need you to get suctioned into the screen. Beautiful blow by attacking the rim. Another showtime slam. Beautiful. Frank is doing a great job attacking the rim. He's knocked down a pretty good amount of whites as well. He's playing good so far. I just cannot green with this release to save my life. And that's really my own fault. I can't blame him. I know people who are really good with this release. It's just not me. Look at the defense, though. Beautiful. AK is a monster. Another wide open shot. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Defensively, we could play. You just can't get any sort of can't get any sort of offense going. As I turn the ball over again, there's just no way. Is he in a zone? I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. Frank, come on. He shot a straight arm. The one shot I green, and it's a straight arm. Oh, that hurts me, bro. One more offensive possession, we'll get the bench in, bro. Cause like, I just don't know, man. I just can't green. And then the one shot I green is a, is a full. It's so tough. He's in a zone too. Imagine. Whatever. We'll pass out of the zone. Kawhi, good shot. Let's get Frank some rest. Uh, yeah, yeah. Frank, penetrate the zone. I do not enjoy playing against a zone. Good pass. Green. Big shot. Let's go. That's a straight arm, but we'll take it. It's a big white. I just can't believe I'm struggling this bad against a zone. Like, I do not struggle against zones like this. But good pass. AK wide open. You don't leave AK. Come on. We'll keep it. We'll keep distributing with Frank. If he's going to sit in the zone, we will distribute the ball. My players have just been sliding on defense all game, bro. Look at Frank, bro. Good. Great defense. Yes, sir. Showtime slam me. Let's go. Y'all can see the impact that Frank makes on defense, bro. He's so good on the defensive end of the court. We need one bucket out of you, Frank, and we can win this game. Can D-Rose hold you? Let's find out. I know Pau Gasol not holding Wes on, so I'll tell y'all that. Hey, I won. Let's go. Dot. Green. Bro, I cannot green his release. Big White, that's going to close out this game. But, bro, I just don't know, man. Look at him even getting a contest there. Like, I mean, Frank, defensively, he's incredible. Offensively, if you can green his release, he's really good. But, like, I can't green his release to save my life. Hopping into the box score. Let's see what Frank did. He had 34, 5, and 3 steals. 5 turnovers, unfortunately. 14 of 23, 6 of 14 from 3. And, I mean, y'all saw he's very impactful on the defensive end. He does a really good job. And he's good on offense, too. The main issue with this card is I cannot green his release. Base 4, I just suck with. I'm so bad at If you can green base 4, this card is amazing. For only 500 MT in the glitch market, he's an absolute stud. But the question is... Can you green his release? And for me personally, I just can't green his release. So this is not a card that I probably would use in the future. But that being said, I think he is a really good card overall. Hopping back into the main menu. Y'all basically heard my thoughts on this Frank Nielakina card already, to be honest. So I'll keep it short. He's a great card. Really good budget point guard. Super cheap. Obviously, if you get in the glitch market and he's an opportunity, I would recommend buying. For 500 MT, I mean, you're not going to get any better value in this game. If you can get this card, he's a stud. The only issue with this card is his release. Y'all know that. I mean... If you can green base four, then more power to it. If you had Donovan Mitchell, you can green his release. Guys like that, then 
he's going to be a monster for you. But for me personally, I can't green his release, so I'm just going to struggle on the offensive end using this card. But uh, overall, I think y'all saw that he does a really good job. He's amazing on defense, and he can perform on offense as well very admirably. So um, that's going to do it for this video. I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did enjoy the video, please make sure you hit that like button. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of the video. And uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't. We're on that grind to 1.1k subscribers now. So if you could hit that subscribe button, it'd be much appreciated. Appreciate y'all boys a lot. And I'll be back with another 2k video very, very soon. Appreciate y'all. Peace.